everybody, welcome to the Diesel of Two video, and we just saw, I just saw the direct for September, and I've got to say, there were some highlights in that one that got me excited. Obviously, Super Mario RPG remake that's coming out this year is one of the highlights, with it being, you know, Obviously, we made, we finally got the reason why we had the percentage in the bottom on the left hand screen. And the reason is the more actions we take, the percentage goes up. And when you get to 100%, you get a special attack. Flip it on, let's see you have a new group. That's awesome. Then, Nintendo dropped a new but that's something really cool. But one of my favorite series as you know is Mario vs. Donkey Kong. They're remaking Mario vs. Donkey Kong. Thank you, Nintendo. That looks so awesome. I love the original and I love the series. Princess Peach Showtime looks good. Now I, you know, I thought it was gonna be Super Princess Peach too because you know, but no. And no, Bowser's not the main villain in this game. Um, we also got Splatoon 3's new DLC announced, and then Nintendo drops a else on us. Another 99 competition. This time in the form of F Zero. Now, I played F Zero. I will not say I hate it. It's hard, but playing up against 99 other player, 98 other players will be fun. And then we got Tomb Raider. Now, I myself, I played Tomb Raider. I played a, a little bit of it, and I'm excited for that. I'm trying to think what else we got. Oh. And, and the new booster pass. The last wave. Looks amazing. Funky Kong. Daisy. I mean, Toad. Uh, Pizzette. Uh, Diddy Kong, they're all back. <laughs> but then they dropped, and then, then of course we got Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, which is coming out next year as well. I will definitely buy that game. And then finally we got the biggest announcement yet. So, there have been rumors going around that a certain Paper Mario game is getting remade. If everybody knows how much I like the Paper Mario series, there's one game in particular I really, 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 really like. And other than Paper Mario 64, it's Super Paper Mario. And that's Paper Mario tells you door. We got a look into the remake of Paper Mario tells you door. Oh, I also want to talk about that. I'll talk about it in a minute. I really like. I'm excited for that. So I also want to talk about the added post game bosses. Yes. For Super Mario RPG remake, I myself was always wondering what ha what would have happened if Nintendo actually gave us a post game. Well, they did it. The bosses are harder, more challenging, which I think is kind of cool. So I might just try it out. I'm kind of disappointed in some of the games that we kind of. Gotta look at 
I did it so I seen the ne the Nintendo Museum and then they're gonna be creating. Um I kinda of was disappointed that we got no Zelda stuff. I mean we did we did get a new game. But again, Tears of the Kingdom just came out not that long ago. We got Amiibos. And we got a few other games. Um, League of Legends games. Which is cool. I might try them out. Both of them. I think that is about it. Again. I'm ready for, for Super Mario Wonder. I'm ready for Super Mario RPG remake. Which again I've been really excited for. I'm ready for... FCO 99, which I really, really, really am excited to play with other people. Oh, and Among Us. I forgot. Among Us is getting a brand new map. I forgot. Completely forgot about Among Us. Called the, Fug the Fuggle. It's pretty cool. I'm really excited for that. Anyway, there you go. That's are my thoughts about today's um, direct. And later on, I will do a tier list about how I felt about the uh, today's direct. Like, comment, subscribe, share. I'll see you guys on the next video.